Hi guys. Thanks for coming in to another video. It feels like I've it feels like it's been ages since I have done a video. I had a quite a cold going on actually over the weekend. And um I'm feeling way better now. So I don't know whether it was some sort of weird allergy. But I also pumped myself full of vitamin C and echinacea. And it literally, it was, I mean, it was, it was a head thing. It was head cold or whatever you want to call it. And, uh, I mean, I didn't have any boxes of Kleenex. I went through an entire roll of toilet paper on Saturday. Anyway, I'm feeling a lot better. So this is a jewelry box. This is a box. There's some jewelry in it. Came from Saskatchewan. This is a one-off. So I just came across this and uh, I ordered it mainly because I really, really need a box. It was a great price. And... Um, but she doesn't have any more stuff. She had like, then it's all kinds of like, I don't know, sport shirts or something like that. I don't think that there's an awful lot in here. Um, so it's not going to be a very long video, but she did say that all of this stuff in here is, um, of her own collection. You see now, well, the pictures look like it was much bigger, but isn't that, a, isn't that a sweet box? Let me just pick up the, isn't that, isn't that sweet? I really liked it. So, um, wonder if I could actually pick this whole thing up. Maybe. And just... That might be a bit better, right? Give you guys a little bit of a better view. So this is from Saskatchewan. And she um, she only had like one item of jewelry. Um, I'm, I'm fanatical about taking tape off of bubble wrap. I'm just... Yeah, I, I don't like it. I don't like, I don't like tape on bubble wrap. It's not necessary. You can just wrap it, right? Isn't that what bubble wrap is for? You wrap it. You don't put tape all over it. Um, thank you for coming in. And this is Divine Treasures Canada. I am located in the Pacific Northwest. And we do things like unboxings, and I do a jewelry auction every Friday at, oh, more, bu more bubble wrap, every Friday, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, and uh, that's um, if you're on the West Coast here, and then if you are, ooh, if you are, um, on the, if you're central time, that's eight. And if you are in the east, that would be nine o'clock. Uh, so we are, we're here every single Friday. So that's a, that's a nice box. It's a wooden box, but it'll, it'll be very handy. So there is a earring. This is sweet. Um, I'm not sure. I don't... Oh, there is a celebrity. I think that says, actually... Do I have my loop here? I should have my loop. Um, oh. Okay. The uh, box clasp is metal yeah I think it just says celebrity I believe oh that's kind of a cute 
cute little thing. I think I'm just gonna maybe put that into my art lot. That's kind of, I don't know. It's not really an earring. It's not really much of anything. I don't recall this having any silver or claiming to have any silver. That's nice. That says love. But I may test some of this stuff. Um, like I said, the price was very good. I can't remember what it was, but it was, um, I think it was like $20 plus shipping. And the shipping was two francs. The shipping was not too terribly expensive either. I think the shipping was about $20 as well. A half penny. <laughs> I know what a half penny is. Cassandra. These are very pretty. So these are going to be $20. Um, they're very nice. Look at the detail of these. I love the etching in the metal. It's very pretty. Um, yeah. As I said, I think that I've got a... Actually, I just got a pair of earrings somewhat like that. And that's another nice silver tone earring. That actually almost... That uh, feels like resin. That's an interesting earring. And we have a pair... Oh, look at those teapot pewter earrings. Oh my gosh, are those ever cool. I love things that are just a bit different. And so we have a, a pair to those. Look at that. Looks like a genie. Uh, mug. There is no, oh, wait a minute. There is a, yeah, there's a, there's a stamp or something on here. What does it say? Oh my, it says silver. It looked like pewter to me, but it says in words, I've never seen that before. It says silver. So this may be like a um, European silver. Let's see if we can show you that. See that? I've never seen that before. So it may be um, like a European Silver, German silver. Anyway, I'll test it. That is really neat. Those are certainly vintage. Very, very unique, though, too. That's what I like about those. They're not sort of the average earring. Okay, so that's a stone or glass. Um, hmm. There's no, uh, it's not silver, but yeah, that's, that's really pretty. That cat eye effect. And we do have another one to that. So that's nice. So we have a pair there. We have a pair there. Nice. Um, and this seems to be... Looks like it was uh, a pendant or an earring or something. I'm not quite sure. Hmm. Oh, boy. 
a charm bracelet. And these look like uh, provincial flags. Montreal, maybe their city. Um, that's kind of neat. I'm not, I don't recognize these at all, so I don't know what they are. Um, what on earth is that? What does that say? Oh my goodness. That's what I thought it says, 85.45. 5A5 New York City. It looks almost like there's a there's a piece of glass over this, so or plastic actually. So nothing could have fallen out of here, but it looks as though there was should have been something something in there. I'm not quite sure. Anyway, that's a brooch. It's kind of neat. Hmm. In gold tone. Oh my. That is really interesting. It has quite a, you know, a structure to it. And uh, I guess it's just supposed to be, yeah, it's supposed to be a pendant. Interesting. Okay, we have another earring to that one. So that's good. We have another earring to this one. Where did that one go? Um, or was this the one that I, no, there it is. Excellent. Must wonder if those are silver. And we have another one to these. Yeah, this is a, that's some sort of a resin. Those are very pretty. And we have a puzzle piece. Who does puzzle pieces? Um, I bet that's supposed to say best friends. Oh, excellent. We have the other earring to this one. So that's fantastic. Really like those. Those are, those are very unique. Unique vintage. And there's a little, there is a little stamp of some kind on, right on the, um, right on here as well. Hmm. So my battery is running low. I hope I don't. Not quite sure what that means. I might see if I can find that symbol anywhere. That's okay. We have a very short, uh, okay. So that's a Japanese symbol. This is, um, almost like, uh, feels like tin. It's very thin. It's a nice spoon. That's a really nice spoon, actually. And it has the uh, sailboat. And what do we have here? Oh, this is kind of nice. This is just a um, gold tone little charm bracelet with lots of really cool little charms. That's neat. <laughs> That articulates. The wheel goes around. That's very neat. And that's the reindeer again. Oh, we have two of those. I wonder what they were supposed to be. I'm not sure. 
Oh, nice. Now that's nice. Oh my goodness. Isn't that gorgeous? That is beautiful. And we have this quite amazing gold tone uh, brooch here. And it is stamped. Oh, what's the stamp on it? Is it Coro? Yes, it is. It's Coro. Very nice. Gold tone red with these pearls. Very pretty. And we have this really sweet shell uh, bracelet in gold tone. And it is stamped as well. It's always nice to get stamped jewelry. And that's stamped Avon. Very nice. And we have another coin here. And that is a franc. Is it a franc? Is that, yes. Oh, no, franc. Uh, yes, it is a franc. Hmm. She must have uh, spent some time in France, I suppose. And I do believe that's it. I do have another haul here. Uh, that I will be bringing to you from my fav favorite little thrift store in Ontario. And my um, it has arrived, but um, I will upload that uh, sometime later this week. Anyway, thank you for dropping in and just looking at this with me. Like I said, I ordered this essentially for the box. I really wanted the box. I love the box. Um, and the fact that some of her jewelry came with it was a bonus. So, um, yeah, please subscribe, please hit the thumbs up and hit the like, and we will see you sometime this week. Thanks so much, guys. Bye for now.